It's almost as though fate simply did not want me to have an enjoyable week. No! You threw off my groove! First, we have the Harry Potter boycott legacy thing. Um, check out that video if you haven't already. That's your plug. Ah, you suck. Next, we have a Nintendo Direct, which apparently has been really cool. Alrighty then. They announced loads of stuff, probably to kind of get away from the fact that their port of 007 Goldeneye wasn't all that great. But it's unfortunately finally rounded out with the events that Disney has announced Frozen 3, Zootopia 2, and Toy Story 5. Because we haven't had a perfect ending to Toy Story once. Wow, a puppy! Twice. Yeah. Not perfect, but, you know, it was all right. Disney, uh, as it turns out, appeared to not have learned any of the lessons that have been going on over the last few years with Marvel fatigue. You can rest now. Star Wars fatigue. Ray Skywalker. No! I mean, they've single-handedly ruined Marvel and Star Wars for me. And now it seems that they're taking me back to my childhood on one of the greatest franchises or greatest tales ever made. Toy Story. Look, I'm Woody. Howdy, howdy, howdy. As creepy as the the film looks now. Once heralded as a technical and engineering masterpiece, an amazing story, and they topped it with the second one, an adventure and tale of magnificence growing and understanding. And then to end with Toy Story 3, the one that brings you to tears. And then came Toy Story 4. <gasps> now don't get me wrong, a masterclass in visuals, but uh, they seem to have misunderstood Buzz Lightyear to a T. What now, inner voice? Mission accomplished. Return to base. I hope they get him right in the next one. But as it always is the case, Twitter's there to help us out on this occasion. It's false. It's false. No way. We got you. Not a chance. Well, Frozen 3 was an inevitability. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> I just refreshed. No. No. <laughs> well, at least Tim Allen is, I guess, voicing it, you know. Ah, uh, Colin. Colin's got it right here, my friends. It's for the money. That delicious moolah. Oh, wait. Hang on. Disney laid off 7,000 employees. No. Oh my god. You're an idiot. Here we go. Let's have a look. Disney announces 7,000 layoffs. Oh, come on. Disney announced a sweeping corporate restructuring that result in 7,000 people losing their jobs as part of an effort to achieve a US $5.5 billion or £4.5 billion in cost saving. Oh, man. <laughs> I win. The estimates represent 3.6% of Disney's global workforce. Why do they need to save this money? Aren't they a multi... How much did Disney earn last year? Well, definitely 2018 was the time to uh, the time to have all of the shares and sell them off. Damn. But I'm guessing it's because they want to get back to this point much sooner. Fair enough. They only made $3.19 billion last year. <laughs> Don't worry though, because the gross domestic product of Andorra last year was uh, just over 3 billion, so at least Disney are still above the GDP of Andorra. And with these layoffs, the best bit is, is they're now saving that plus more. Wow. The layoffs represent an estimated 3.6 of global Disney workforce. And it's to come the same after Alphabet, Amazon, Ford, and Meta. The chief executive, Bob Iger, outlined the cost cut in plan to investors in which Disney net an income in at 1.2 billion below Anna's estimate of 1.43 billion. So hang on, hang on a minute. So because they were off by roughly a hundred million dollars, which chump change to these people, uh, they had to gain another 4.5. Uh, sorry, that's the UK. 5.5 billion dollars. This is is this some Doctor Evil shit going on? Is this some just absolute Dr. Evil 
what's happening right now. I thought Bob Iger was meant to fix Disney. I didn't realize Zootopia was as popular as it was though. I didn't realize that Zootopia earned more than a billion at the box office. It was a fantastic film though. I feel that was one, it, 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 that's Pixar, right? Zootopia's Pixar? Yeah, Zootopia was made by Pixar, of course they were. Well, we all know big mega corporation bad, so let's see what other people think about this. If Toy Story 5 doesn't end with Andy finding his old toys to give to his own son, we riot. Uh, what a beautiful ending, what a beautiful ending that would be, and uh, that would completely undermine Toy Story 3 and 4, so that, that would make everybody angry and happy at the same time, but good suggestion, Nick. If you insist on doing Toy Story 5, hear me out. <laughs> Toy Story 5. <laughs> oh, it's so true. It's so true. Oh, dear. CC so Howard says, with the Toy Story 5 news, now it's as good as time as any to reshare this note I had on my phone from 2015. So let's see what Stacey Howard has to say. In Toy Story, when Woody gets his forehead burned by a magnifying glass, he reacts violently in pain. But in Toy Story 2, when his arm is ripped off, he has no physical reaction besides, oh, she, my arm. So can toys feel pain in the Toy Story universe? What are the rules? Also, can toys die? Is it like death becomes her? when no matter how many times you are injured or fall apart, you're still alive. Would there be dolls from the 1800s buried alive in an attic or landfill, having lived there for over 200 years, slowly going insane, having no contact with anyone somehow? These thoughts are terrifying. I was hoping I was, I'd feel better by reading Twitter, but I guess that ain't happening today now, is it? Not this time. Ah, we found someone insane. I would take a Toy Story 5, 6, and 7 over another Frozen or Zootopia movie. Who is sitting there going like, nah, Zootopia 1 was terrible. Like, come on, man. Darkness is the heart's true nature. <sighs> Whatever you're talking about, I don't care. <laughs> oh. Uh, are they doing an Inside Out 2 as well? I'd, I'd be more about excited about that than anything else. Inside Out 2. Inside Out is great. Yeah, yeah, this, 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 this pretty much sums me up right here. Zootopia 2, I'm down. There's potential there. I completely agree, by the way. Frozen 3, meh, but it was a uh, foregone conclusion. It makes way too much money not to. Toy Story 5, boo. I agree. Toy Story 5, boo. Just leave it alone. Leave it. We all want an end. It's like you're kicking a dead horse. It's like uh, that Simpsons meme. Stop. Stop. He's already dead. Yes, D Knight. I totally agree with you. Do I, do I click? Do I not? 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 <laughs> I guess for everybody who loves Toy Story, um, which I did, I did and until Toy Story Four, where I felt like um, they kind of um, that was that was me done. To everybody who loved Toy Story, I'm never gonna sit here and say, do you know what? Actually, this is a terrible idea. I like the Toy Story Three level from Kingdom Hearts. You know, that's that's all I gotta say about that. But but genuinely, I I don't think I, I there's no way that I can perceive this to be good. If a Toy Story 4 is... Maybe they'll bring it out. I hope they bring it out of the park. Let me know. Comment section below. Hit the like button uh, uh, as ever. You know, my Patreons and my members on the left-hand side of the screen. You guys are legends. Big thanks to Maya, Logan, Buddha, my 25-tier Patreon subscribers. You guys are legends as well. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.